All right, I'm back. Um, I didn't go out looking today because I'm beat from all the looking I did the last yesterday. Um, I'm showing points that I found personally before I started doing YouTube. I haven't even been doing YouTube a year yet. This is a Paleo Lance. Um, a few hunts ago, I found like a Art Deco bracelet with glass in it and a fish spear and a real nice nutting stone. I found this point on that site years ago. I would say in uh, oh, about 1997, 1998. It's just a straight up early paleo lance. It's early paleo um, from the other stuff that's come on. It's got great edge work, but look at this. It's as thin as a dime. The full length of the blade. It's just, this is the kind of stuff I'm looking for when I'm out. I've been finding some pretty nice points and stuff. Um, I think my favorites from the last couple weeks have been them Flint Ridge bird points because they're hard for me to find. They're tiny and they're just, there's not a lot of them. But this point is beautiful. It's beautiful black flint. Um, it's beautifully made. It's ground up to about here on the base. It's very unique and all I have... I think I have four other ones from the site. I have one that would have been this big and it's broke like right here and it's made exactly the same and they all come off one beach from around one fire hearth. And this is the best one. I have several that are about, you know, that long. Inch and a half long maybe. But it's got the basal thinning on it. It's just beautiful. And you know, when, when have you seen one that's that thin? That's why I like this. This is top 100 finds for me of all time. I'd say it cracks 100. I have a lot of other stuff I haven't shown, but I'm just kind of holding it back for times when the water is up and I can't go out and look and get on video, so that's when I'll show the rest of it. But you can see how beautiful this point is, how beautifully it's made. And this is 10,000 BC, uh, I'd say it the, the, the earliest, and I'd say it's in, I'd say it dates in around 9,000 to 9,500 BC. It's a very old point. It was made during the last ice age, the end of the last ice age. There was still ice sheets on northern Ohio when this was made. It's got some white specks in it, which are fossils, and then towards the top, it's much blacker. It just, just swirled like black flint, and it's just beautiful. It's parallel chipped. You can see the parallel chips coming in, but it's just so thin it doesn't... Most of these that I find aren't this thin. And this is a work of art. It's four and a fourth inches. I found a stemmed one made a Nelly chert earlier this summer, in a, or earlier this year. Um, wasn't summer, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm tired. But, uh, it's arguably for what it is, it's a stemmed one, but this one's made way better. It's twice as nice in my opinion. The paleo stuff's hard to come by. You know, I found, I find 20 broken ones to one whole one, usually. This is a beautiful piece. I'll probably get out tomorrow a little bit, do some hunting, so hopefully I can get a video, hunting video on here in the next couple days. I'll try to keep it going. But there you go, I hope you enjoy. I'll show you some more points on my days off that I've found over the years. This is again a personal find, and it's you know one of my top 100 favorite personal finds for what it is. See how nice that is. I'm sure anybody would be happy to find this anywhere. I sure was. Definitely a month maker. When I found it, it was probably one of the top finds of the year. I haven't lucked on to a bunch of real good stuff. I use, I'm on kind of a dry spell on spectacular paleos. I haven't found one for a while except that stem lance. And it's pretty nice, but I have other ones just like it. It's... You know, I don't have many with this form of it. It's kind of coffin shaped and it's a little bit different form than the last one I found. It's a dandy.
just how it was left. It just washed out of the bank by fire earth, and you can see that again there. It's just a work of art. I'd like to meet the man who made this. Wow. Or just have at least watched him nap it. Wow. You know? There you go. Enjoy. I'll be back with a video of me out hunting for these in a few days. And hopefully I'll find enough to get a video. I was struggling yesterday. I got that place picked over. I might go back there next weekend. But I even doubt it. I might go someplace else. So later. Alright, I'm back. I just wanted to show you this here on a white background and with a penny beside it. You can see how big it is here. Show it just for a minute more. Because this is going up. Again, this is a paleo piece. You can see how thin it is here. It's just dime thin. I don't think at any section of it it's thicker than a quarter. Maybe right in here, but that's it. It's a dandy. Well, hope you enjoy. Later.